The Otago Chamber of Commerce has lost its chief executive, who's taken up the leadership of Enterprise Dunedin. It's a new role within a newly formed organisation, and Director John Christie is here to tell us about his transition. Good evening, John. Yeah, good evening. Now, how long have you been with Enterprise Dunedin? Uh, this is my third official week, so just relatively new into the role. And you've still been doing a little bit of work for the Chamber? I did up until a transition time when we went up to China to celebrate the 20th anniversary of our sister city relationship. Mm. And that was the point at which I exited from one role and started the other. And tell us a little bit about your new role. What does it entail? Well, it's pretty broad. We cover all of the city's economic development, uh, tourism, eyesight, you know, visitor site, and city marketing and branding. So it's a pretty wide and diverse portfolio. How is it different to what you were doing with the Chamber? Oh, it's quite a different role. I mean, the Chamber really is there uh, to work on behalf of its members and to advocate on behalf of that constituency. Uh, this is a much broader role and encompasses a lot more around the economic development area. It's, uh, it's I guess, about how we grow our city's economy so those businesses uh, that the Chamber would represent um, can do better in that environment. Mm. Uh, so it's much more about some community good and I think, uh, you know, really does encompass quite a, a wider agenda in terms of our, our daily workload. Now I know you're only a few weeks in, but what sort of challenges have you come up against so far? Uh, well, obviously the one that's been uh, front and centre has been win winning Gigatown, and we're pretty committed to supporting uh, the work that's been going on by the team there to ensure that the city's well positioned to take advantage of that. And with a short time left to go, I, you know, we certainly encourage all people to get in there and, and vote for Dunedin's plan, which has been comprehensively put together by the team that have been working on that. Uh, but beyond that, it's about um, increasing uh, the visit, visitor share that we've got in our market, uh, looking at those big economic development opportunities and making sure Dunedin is getting out there and making sure that we're getting um, the best we can out of some of those opportunities. What excites you about Enterprise Dunedin? Well, it's a great team of people that work there, a very diverse range of people obviously with that sort of portfolio and uh, they're, they're talented at what they do and they're really, um, I think they're good to work alongside. Uh, personally, I'm, I'm really enjoying getting to know, you know what they do for our city and if anything, we probably haven't been telling people about some of those successes and uh, we look, we're looking to, to try to change that. Mm. So what are some of the priorities for marketing Dunedin? Uh, well, at the moment we have got uh, growth in our tourism market. In fact, we're up 7%, which is slightly ahead of the national average and it's about making sure that people know what Dunedin has to offer, uh, working with those that are looking to bring conventions here, uh, working with the visitor industry to, to make sure they're aware of Dunedin's offering and looking offshore at how we can bring some of those offshore tourists into our city. So quite a bit of work to really to do around the tourist sector and you know, very again, very diverse role that we have to play there mm. with relatively small resources. Mm. Mm. What are your goals in your first year? Uh, well, we definitely need to make sure that we're growing our economy. The 10,000 jobs, uh, $10,000 mm -hmm. GDP per household is a big target for us. Mm -hmm. It's one that's been set through the partnership with the Grow Dunedin Partners and we've got an integral role in facilitating that and making sure that um, that wealth uh, filters through to our local households. Mm. What do you think Dunedin's growth will be like in the next few years? Oh, I'm pretty confident that we've got, a, we've got a great city, we've got some really good businesses that are operating from here and we've got to get out and tell the rest of the world what we have to offer. Enterprise Dunedin Director John Christie, thanks very much for your time. Thank you.